Welcome back to Jetline Marvel for another thrilling episode of the aircraft comparison. Boeing is one of the oldest and most recognizable companies in the aviation sector, having produced a wide range of aircraft ranging from commercial to military aircraft. We'll talk about two airplanes that have transformed the aviation business in terms of size and volume capacity in this video. We'll talk about the Boeing 777X and the Boeing 747. The Boeing 777X is the latest series of the long-range, wide-body, twin-engine jetliners in the Boeing 777 family from Boeing Commercial Airplanes. The Boeing 777X is a game-changer for commercial aircraft, since it features numerous improvements in aircraft design and technology that will undoubtedly help airlines. The Boeing 747 is the company's most famous aircraft, having been introduced in 1969. Initially, this aircraft was dubbed the engineering marvel because it was designed without the use of advanced technology. The team of 4,500 engineers took just 29 months to design and build the first jumbo Boeing 747. It is, without a doubt, a magnificent aircraft. With the passage of time, most jumbo aircraft began to experience decreasing market demand, causing the Boeing 747's production to suffer. And this aircraft was powered by four engines, each of which consumed a lot of gasoline, took a long time to maintain, and cost a lot of money to buy. Because of all of these issues, this aircraft was gradually phased out of manufacturing. On the other hand, there is still a market for medium-capacity aircraft with roughly 400 to 450 seats. So, Boeing has unveiled a new plan called the Boeing 777X, which will ostensibly replace the Boeing 747. Let's take a closer look at the Boeing 777X. It is intended to replace the Boeing 777 wide-body aircraft. It is the most popular widebody aircraft to date. It was first introduced in 1994 and has since undergone several revisions. On board the B777X, the story continues. It features various improvements while keeping the 777 seconds basic design and metal fuselage construction. Let's have a look at how the 777X differs from the 747 in terms of passenger capacity. The 777X will be available in two sizes, the larger 777-9 and the smaller 777-8. According to Boeing data, it has a capacity of up to 426 passengers in a two-class configuration. The smaller 777-8 will seat roughly 384 passengers and will compete directly with the A350-1000. The B777-9 is a good match for the 747. According to Boeing, the newer and larger 747-8 has a normal capacity of 410 passengers, this is in a three-class configuration. It is, nevertheless, graded up to a maximum of 563. The 747-8 is operated by Lafonso in a four-class configuration with 364 passengers. The entire length of 777-9 is 251 feet 9 inches. At 250 feet 2 inches, the 747-8 is slightly smaller. The wingspan of the 747-8 is 224 feet 5 inches. With its massive 261 feet 8 inches wingspan, the A380 carried this even further. With folding wingtips, the 777X will be able to get past this category restriction. The wingspan is 235 feet 5 inches when fully expanded. The wingtips fold to lower the length to 212 feet 8 inches on the ground. The Boeing 777X is fitted with GE9X engine, which was recently built, is the world's largest commercial jet engine to date. These have a larger diameter fan with 16, rather than 22 blades, lighter carbon fiber composite materials, and a greater bypass ratio. The Boeing 777-9 has a height of roughly 64.7 feet, 
while the Boeing 747-8i has a height of around 63.6 feet. The Boeing 777-9 has a maximum takeoff weight of 351 tons, while the Boeing 747 has a maximum takeoff weight of 447.7 tons. The Boeing 777-9 has a maximum payload of 73.5 tons, while the Boeing 747 has a payload of 76.1 tons. The Boeing 777-9 has a fuel capacity of 52,300 US gallons, while the Boeing 747 has a fuel capacity of 59,734 US gallons. The range of the Boeing 777-9 is 13,500 km, while the Boeing 747 is 14,310 km. These new engines have a record-breaking thrust of 110,000 pound force, making them the world's most powerful engines. These engines, which were designed expressly for the 777X family, save 10% more fuel than the GE90s and are at the heart of the plane's efficiency enhancements. According to Boeing, the new planes should be more enticing to passengers, with larger windows, a wider cabin, better lighting, and new architecture being among the major characteristics to entice customers on board the new 777X. Most of the Boeing 777X technology is identical to that of the B787, although its windows are much larger and the engine noise is significantly reduced. The cockpit instruments have been improved, and the aircraft is expected to feature some of the most current aviation avionics, which will undoubtedly improve the aircraft's performance. The main goals of the Boeing 777X are to compete with the A350 and to replace the iconic four-engine Boeing 747 aircraft. Its cabin interiors are wider than any other aircraft, allowing for increased cargo capacity and a more roomy cabin for passengers. The Boeing 777X has a list price of $388.7 million, while the current list price of a passenger 747-8 is $418.4 million, according to Boeing. As a result, the passenger model is no longer available, and production of the freight variant is nearing completion. So, what are your thoughts on these aircraft? Do you think the Boeing 777X will be able to replace the Boeing 747? Let us know in the comments below.